Hi, welcome to the questions on indefinite integration. Uh, you must have seen many questions uh, like sine x over sine 2x, sine x over sine 3x, sine x over sine 4x. But today I'll teach you sine x over sine 3x. So the question is evaluate sine x dx over sine 3x. Well, what you can do, you can open sine 3x using sine 3 theta. Sine 3 theta is 3 sine theta minus 4 sine cube theta. So this is 3 sine x minus 4 sine cubed x. And you can take sine x common. After when you take sine x common, this is 3 minus 4 sine square x. You can see that it is dx over 3 minus 4 sine square x. And this is a very simple path. So I'm dividing each term by sine square x or cos square x, both ways it will work. You can divide by sine square or you can divide by cos square. If you're dividing by sine square, then the substitution will be cot x. And if we're dividing by cos square, then we will be putting tan x is equal to t. So I'm dividing by cos square x in numerator and denominator. So this is dx over cos square x. So the result is secant square x dx over 3 secant square x minus 4 tan square x. We'll convert this secant square x which is in the denominator to tan form using the identity that secant square theta is 1 plus tan square theta. So using this identity we'll open the denominator keeping the numerator as it is. So this is 3 1 plus tan square x minus 4 tan square x. Now we'll put tan x is equal to t. This is the substitution. So after when you put tan x is equal to t, this is secant square x dx is equal to dt. So the numerator turns to dt. The denominator becomes 3 minus t square. So we're ready for the special integration. We'll be writing 3 as root 3 square minus a t square. So the special integration is 1 by 2a log mod a plus x over a minus x. So the answer is root 3 by 6 log mod root 3 plus tan x upon root 3 minus tan x plus c. So with a little practice, you can be damn hero and master in indefinite integration. So keep watching, uh, keep uh, sharing and do subscribe our channel AVTA. Thank you.